going on everybody? Protein Bar Review Guy here with another review for today. We have another adventure into the Costco world of protein bars. Here we've got chocolate chip cookie dough. All right, before we get started, remember to reach down, hit like and subscribe, and share with a friend who you think would benefit from learning more about protein bars. All right, we base them on ingredients, protein content, macros, calorie count, taste, texture, and we give them an overall score of one through 10. All right, <clears throat> so we tried a couple other Costco bars on this channel. Um, this is a new flavor one. Let's run down the ingredients here. All right, we start off with a protein blend of milk protein isolate and whey protein isolate, two good sources of protein for a bar. Then we get into the soluble corn fiber, cashew butter, isomalto oligosaccharides, from a vegetable source, unsweetened chocolate, erythritol, water, cocoa butter, natural flavors, sea salt, sunflower lecithin, stevia, and then it says it contains milk and cashews. All right, so not bad for a protein bar, really. Um, I guess the uh, isomalto oligosaccharides is used for a carb source here. Um, plenty of fiber, they're giving you 10 grams of fiber, so you know, don't eat more than one of these at a time. Uh, really the only sketchy thing in here is the natural flavors because we don't know what that is. Um, you know, there's no aspartame, there's no acesulfame potassium, there's no sucrose, any artificial sweeteners like that. They're using stevia and erythritol, which are both, I think like a one or a two on the glycemic index scale. So much better than the bars you find that have maltitol in them or maltitol syrup. This is way better. Um, you know, and they're using sunflower lecithin instead of soy lecithin, so, you know, points for that. And uh, pretty good, pretty good ingredients uh, for a protein bar, I guess. Um, I guess I'd have to give it a nine. Um, really only knocking points for the natural flavors. Talk about the protein content you got 21 grams okay that's good so we you know we like to see above you know 20 or above and it's only 190 calories so protein content um, I'm gonna give it a nine I'm gonna give it a nine for that and uh, carbs you got 22 grams of carbs and seven grams of fat so macro wise uh, you know I'd like to see more protein than carbs and then the seven grams of fat that's kind of like medium, you know, it's it's not a lot, but you know, we've, we've seen some other bars that have like three or four grams of fat, which is good. And then there's some other ones that have 10, 12, you know, even 16, 18 grams of fat. Um, so this is kind of middle of the road. I guess, I guess I'll give it a, I guess I'll give it a six for macros there. Um, I'd like to see a little, maybe more protein and less carbs and then less fat as well. Because uh, this is 190 calories, you've got 21 grams of protein, so that's 84 calories from protein. So not bad. I mean, at least it's over half, over half the bar is protein. Whereas I think yesterday we reviewed a bar that had, you know, that was roughly 38% of the bar was protein, um, and the rest was, you know, junky, uh, you know, carbs and fat. Um, okay, so so uh, you know, macros we're giving it a six. Calorie count. Um, yeah, we'll give it an eight for that. I think, you know, I think that's right where it should be, 190 calories. And let's see how this thing tastes. All right, so a lot different than some of the other cookie dough bars we've reviewed before that pretty much were just like a, a blob. Um, I mean, there's, there's big chunks of chocolate in there. Um, so, this looks pretty good. And it's chewy. I like the texture. You know, it's got the got some substance to it. Um, taste. Um, yeah, I, I get the cookie dough taste. Um, I mean, the best part about it, I, I think, is those 
those chunks of chocolate. Those things, those taste phenomenal. Uh, there's big chunks. Um, you don't have to worry about getting a bite with no chocolate in it. It looks like there's big chunks of chocolate throughout this bar. Um, not like that pure protein one that has little, little specks of chocolate mixed in with the cookie dough. Um, so, taste is pretty good. Uh, the cookie dough, uh, kind of average, average taste there. Um, a little bit of a syrupy aftertaste to it. I'm not really sure what that's from because there's no syrups in here. Um, I guess that's uh, maybe from the isomalto oligosaccharides, whatever carbiness there, there is in there um, to give it that gelatinous uh, property. I guess that's uh, maybe what's breaking down to the syrupiness or maybe it's the natural flavors. But uh, anyways, chocolate's pretty good. I like the chocolate. I'd say the cookie dough flavor, kind of middle of the road. Um, so taste, I'll give it an eight. Texture, uh, pretty good, pretty chewy, uh, pretty good chunks of chocolate in there. So that's good for that. Um, yeah, texture, I'll, texture, I'll give it a, I'll give it a nine, nine for texture. There's, you know, good chunks of chocolate in there. It's pretty good and it's chewy. Um, it's chewy already. I mean, if I put this in the fridge and got it cool, you know, it'd be even uh, tougher, you know, so even better. But uh, yeah, right now it's pretty good, warm. This is room temperature. It's Vegas, so it's like 90 today. And this is sitting on my counter. Um, and it's not overly soft and uh, it's not melting or anything. So, all right, so let's check it out. Ingredients, we like the ingredients. We like the protein content. Uh, the macros, not the best, but we've seen worse. Calorie count, right where it should be for a bar, I think. Um, and the taste was pretty good, and the texture was pretty good. So overall score on this thing, um, I'm gonna give it an eight. Uh, there we go, all right. Chocolate chip cookie dough from Costco, the Kirkland brand, getting an eight from Protein Bar Review Guy. All right, I'll catch you later.